Hi, hi, it's Yvonne. So it is now Wednesday the 9th, and I promised you guys we would go back to Life Network and finish yesterday because I was there for what, like half an hour. Um, but I forgot, I like to help moderate Jocelyn's whatnot, and that doesn't end till 4 o'clock my time. And then fix something to eat for hubby. <laughs> pet the dog and so now it's like five o'clock so we are going to do that's cute i'm going to get this so we're going to do um the arc instead all right you guys and i'll try to catch life network mm, thursday or friday that's pretty isn't it with the sunshine we're in the foyer that looks really pretty so it's not a big sale day since it's just wednesday one color on sale and that is yellow so far all i've done is raided an abandoned cart for something kind of cool it's like it's got legs in it look at that legs some kind of light a port a fan and a built-in mouse pad so it'll hold like your ipad or your laptop i need that really really bad <laughs> 8.99 not on sale that still seems like a great deal these are adorable made in china 8.99 i'm not sure wait a minute those aren't salt and pepper. I'm not sure what those are. This is obviously a teapot. $10.99. What? So I guess this is just decoration. Kind of tempted by the teapot. Wished I was here on a sale day, but it is what it is. I'm kind of tempted by this. It's normally not my groove. I wish it was in a little bit better condition, but I just like it with the like lace parasol it's not quite dresden made in japan 4.99 oh definitely has, would need cleaned up oh you know what i think she's missing something too out of that hand so oh darn so over it what is that big lots or something wait a minute walmart i don't know i like it though I do. <laughs> I'm feeling that right now. <laughs> a couple of things. So, but that's good for me. I'm kind of getting some of the dust off of me, some of the crispiness, crunchiness <laughs> that I've been experiencing. Oh my goodness. Crystal de France. Ah. That's plastic. Those are new, but nice, right? In memory of always with our heart, might be missing the top, kind of like an urn. 1-800 flowers. <laughs> 4 dollars made in China. That looks a little bit older, not a lot, but I just like it with, I thought it was a butterfly, but it's a bow. <laughs> it's still kind of endearing, isn't it? Let's see this pottery piece. It's got some cracking there, but that's interesting. $2.99. Mm, see, it's got that like Italian kind of like, you know, Batosi vibes, sort of. Very raw though. I better pass. Let's not get crazy. Let's see this big llama. Plastic llama. Night light, huh? Totally new, but that probably looks great when you turn it on. I bet you. Be a fun little booth item, huh? Oh, that's attached. Darn. Hmm. Somebody upcycled it. Okay. No, the restroom's in the back corner. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> You'll see it. <laughs> That's like the employee, you know, employee thing. Oh, that's going to be a yes. Yes, it is a little terracotta cat yes going into the cat sale 
big chunk of glass. You guys don't mind my uber pickiness. It's not a big sale day. Just one color is on sale today. I'm missing the teapot, but I want to see whose it is. 1994. $3.99. It still look kind of cool, upcycled, huh? For $3.99. A little bit better quality. Almost Yadro colors, but definitely not. That's not the Yadro color palette. It's kind of sweet. Now, if she was a pixie, if they finished her out, she's kind of pixie-ish, right? But if they had like wings or something to make her... Oh, you know what? She probably did have wings. <laughs> I was going to say, then that would be a little bit more appealing. An Italian bell. Hmm. Wait a minute. What is that? That's not Italian. Is it? That's is that Greek? I do not know. Okay. Flip side. Oh, is that one of those little nickname vomit pieces? More gravelly. It's got a little diamond eyes. Dollar ninety nine. Yes. Get that. I'm trying to get to this. <laughs> Hang on. Cause it looks like it's got a little crystal in it. And there's a little fused glass piece or melted. Sorry, my bad. Melted. milk glass I know it's a collector plate but hang on there's no date on it and I just love those bunnies what is that the artist signature Goebel okay Germany 1975 you know what I think I'm gonna get that I'm gonna save that for Easter time that 3d relief that's cute let me see what I missed back here. Another piece of glass. This looks vintagey. It's got a little bit of lead crystal in it too. I can't quite make out that mark. Is that IG? Is that Imperial glass? That's got real potential. Sure wish it was a sale day. <laughs> wow. That's got potential. It's a new piece, metal, 249. I just like that seahorse. I would want to take out that middle piece and replace it with something, maybe have mom cut out a piece of, real pretty piece of glass. I might get that for me, for my bathroom. Is that, is that for like desktop football? I believe in family, I believe in love, I believe in us. It's not a Ray Dunn piece. No. Not too bad. Oh, this is funny. Now look at this. Cop's hat. $7.99. What does that say? Year 2000, Van Mark. Retro vintage on the verge. Kind of cool. Australia. More Australia. <laughs> Few pieces of the Avon left. This is where we got Becky's um, Viking ship. She just got home the other day, so we haven't caught up. I've talked to her today, but she picked me up something for the cat sale at the Goodwill she's at shopping. That's kind of how we do. 
but I haven't caught up with her yet. But I think she knows that I got it for her. Piece of recycled glass. I'm gonna put that in the cart. I wanna check that out. <laughs> I have a piece with similar to this. Now oh, that's gonna be for a light or someone just made it that, so that it could be because boy it's awful heavy to want to use for a lampshade or maybe they were gonna make like a tiered assemblage or something out of it. But I've got a piece similar with that frosted rose 3D relief thing on it and it has silver um, base, metal base. It's really cute. I kept it. Spanish guitar. Hand painted ceramic swan. Oh lord. Someone needs to have me quit buying the ceramic. No, no more swans unless it's super epic vintage. Alright, backing up for those that like that view. See how much this is for my little vintage religious item shelf. Mmm, <laughs> hobbyist piece. Not bad, almost there, not quite. Talavera. That's interesting with the extra around the edges, isn't it? marble onyx pieces probably what Mexico it's kind of cute I'm gonna pass for now might be something might strike my fancy on a sale day village of Tobaccoville North Carolina made in China all right It's a nice cute piece. It's new. That is actually just metallic um, ceramic, you guys. Dolphins. Don't want to pay that much. Baby shower. I'm buying lots of little trinkets for assemblages, assemblages that I'm going to be doing. I've got a lot of cute pieces I've been saving that just have like a little, you know, a little nick here and there. And I'm like, oh, I have to save you. Plus, Becky gave me a bunch of Fenton pieces that have a little chip. That's all. $7.99. <laughs> Look, there's Dalton when he was a baby. <laughs> no slippers, son. Dalton. One of the cutest kids ever. Lots of these. With different sub patterns on them, you know. Are you chilling? Huh? <laughs> Five ninety nine, are you just chilling? Oh my gosh. Swans again. Please. Three ninety nine. I think I have one of those. Oh, look at all of them though. Let's see if there's any that are epic and that, uh, that I really feel like I can go ahead and add. I'll have to start another bin soon if I'm not careful. There they are, all the swans. All the swans. Okay, let me catch up. I haven't added too much. Um, this mug is a Harry Potter mug, Hallmark collab for $2.99. I don't know a whole lot. I don't think I've even watched any of the movies, but that's pretty good quality and cool looking. And I just know vicariously through other people watching their stuff that um, sometimes Harry Potter stuff, some of it's kind of epic as far as resale value. I want to add this to the cat sale, just throw it in the buy it now. 
what am I going to pay? $2.99. Just throw it in to buy it now for, I don't know, somewhere under $10. It's super cute. It's a 2000 um, journal. It's all nice glossy sheets. And each one has like a saying. Um, I don't know. I, I, I just think someone would like it. And it's got some artwork. There was one in here that was really funny. It's like one of them said, um, dogs think they are human. Cats think they are God. <laughs> it was funny. The cat pours his body on the floor like water. It is restful just to see him. Okay. Oh, there it was. Anonymous. Yeah, and then some accompanying artwork. I think someone will like that. And I found another one of these vintage news things. News reporter notebook. Just like you see on TV in the old movies. Where they like pull it out and they flip it open. <laughs> so that's cool. Uh, that's all. Oh no, a soap dish. Soap dish. A soap dispenser. My smiley face soap dispenser is going bad this spring. And I've been having trouble finding another one. But... I can just add this uh, smiley stickers galore all I want to that one and I got a power strip and this little broken piece of glass off of something um, I'm going to get that and save it for when I do assemblages and I'm sending Kate follow that bug vintage housewarming thing that's a bag for her and do like this dress now it's a size too big couple sizes but it is the best softest little material fully lined in like a cotton gauze it's got the sm the like puckered smuckered not smuckered that's jelly the puckered <laughs> smock the yeah, other smock and puckered smuckered yeah <laughs> back that is so comfortable adjustable straps and it's a you know it's a decent name it is fast fashion but it's not like a Shein or anything thank goodness a little bit better quality so I want to whoa so I kind of want to get that hang on let me put I did try it on over my clothes but it's super cute and flowy so I think I can have this altar to fit me it's just so flowy and just a nice cut Hey, don't pay attention to my big floppy shoes. I'll wear something cuter for with this. These are just neoprene floppy flops. Okay. So, we're going to get this gorgeous little gingham looking dress up. You guys could feel how soft and flowy this fabric is. You would understand why I'm going to go ahead and buy a piece of fast fashion. And then it's lined. Okay, I'm going to look at jewelry. We are at jewelry. I did pick this up on the way it was over at books for some reason books <laughs> so I'm like oh well if somebody doesn't want it sojourner I think that's a decent brand $4.99 I'm trying to think I feel like I have a prismatic belt bag it's brighter than this though I, th I think I want that too okay so the jewelry I pulled this out so far real quick because you know it just was so bright and cheery do I want this crazy thing someone made this and it's only $1.99 there's something about it I think would be fun you put it up against the wall I don't know I just think something about it would be fun I'm gonna get that and then this rosary is only $1.99 isn't that a cute one with the rainbow? Each little heart has a rhinestone in it. Let me bring it over also. Hang on. Look how cute that is. Yeah. I think I'll get that. This pie bird. Okay, let me back up. This is like a go back. So, I took a peek in it, of course. There's no name on this. I like the color. It almost looks like a repop. And that looks like Rachel Ray colors. So I'm just not sure if I should do that or not. But it's cute, right? Yeah, Pie Bird. Do people still use Pie Birds or just collect them? And 
I thought about this, but it is chipped, and that's a shame. Let me pull it out. This vintage. Okay, look how cute this little boudoir. It's got celluloid, cellulose, cellulose, I think. <laughs> but it is chipped. It's just a minor one, though. Isn't that sweet? Darn. That's a bummer. Okay, but so far I'm on board with these. So you guys can look with me. I know it's probably hard to see in these plastics, right? Let's maybe just enjoy the crinkly noise <laughs> while I look. And I'll show you something up close if I pull it out, okay? Bangles. As you guys can see, I've got my bracelets on today. Um, Kate's got us all wanting to whip out our bracelets. And I was like, well, yeah, I have all these cool bracelets. I never wear them. I'm kind of get in the way of shopping, though, quite frankly. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> Look at that fun one. Those are new, like, from a little kid's store, like Justice or something. All right. Let's check this out. Then I think I'll run up to the Goodwill. Depending on how long this video was, I may add it or I may make it a separate video. Okay, these are all just... Nothing to get too excited about, you guys. All very lightweight or some shells or like Mardi Gras beads. Today's not a sale day to be looking in the case, but... Let's do it anyways. <laughs> but I'll be hard pressed to want to pull anything out when it's not a sale day. Yeah, you guys can't even see in there very well, can you? Alright, I am liking these. Those are fun. This one I think I'll wear before I put it in the booth. Wear a couple times. This is just adorable. Okay, so let's do that. And, although I have my Ikea bag, can always use a good size box. So let's just see if there's an unusual size that I don't have a lot of, or just, you know, something that's really sturdy. No liquor. So you don't, you don't want to do liquor boxes. Um, some places don't even want you to use them. I'm picking this up, you guys. Yeah, I'll just take this little one protect the one of the bowls and then plus I also feel like it would um, entice better entice like porch pirates there's some higher end things they have curated for the wall all right you guys I hope you have a little bit of fun and I will talk to you later bye bye